I still remember life before the war. I remember that we used to be different. We used to live up there, on the surface. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. We crossed the oceans at will. And we also conquered the skies. There used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember it. The seven billion were wiped out by the last war. Only 50,000 managed to survive underground, with the surface poisoned, burnt, and teeming with horrible monsters. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside, and our grandchildren, or their grandchildren, might be able to return there. At least that's what my brothers in arms from the Order believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We tried to make the best of what we had, banded together, and worked to make the Metro our new home. After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth for humans to live. For a time, we thought we could make it, but, regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it. Our numbers dwindling by the day. But I remember we were born for a better life. And I can't accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. I don't care if I'm called an idiot. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal.
Where to now? Left, across the square! Oh, hey, Demir, do you think the Colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? <laughs> How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. He radioed from the ring, said he'd be here tomorrow. Hey, you! Leave him alone! I killed him myself with my slingshot. Let him learn to stand up for himself. Ah, yeah, How right. else can he hope and to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now? The doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel! Hello, Alex. 
There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else, and the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me, so get ready to go. Then we'll discuss your transfer to police. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom? Please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are damn good. They brought Artyom here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Yeah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Eh, well, sadly, it's their job. <laughs> job or no job, if they keep doing that. Artyom, just try to take better care of yourself, huh? <laughs> Even if you find someone else out there, they probably have their own troubles. So what would contacting them even accomplish? Besides, I remember we used to receive signals from the outside pretty frequently soon after the bombs fell. But not for a long time now. Doesn't that tell you anything? Ah well, it's your life. Artyom, I understand how you feel, but you're not always going to save the Metro single-handedly. Why keep looking for a solution alone? Your friends from the Order came to your help again. The Colonel seems to want you back in the unit. Why waste your time in our farming station, or out there looking for ghosts? If Sparta wanted me, I'd join in a heartbeat. Eh, in any case, good luck, Artyom. <laughs> job or no job, if they keep doing that. Well, not everyone can stand being cooped up down here. Huh? And why not? It's what's got us <coughs> Uncle Artyom, huh. don't worry. Do I believe you. <coughs> Will you take me no with you when you find the clean Only place outside? Ten years. <coughs> ten years? We'll be lucky if we make it halfway there. No antibiotics, no suture. Artyom, stop putting delusions into his head. I don't want him going crazy no like you. I can't even sleep since you told him all those perfect. silly stories. Exactly Is that supposed to make him better? Please, leave house. my son alone. There's fewer of us and more of the mutants. And those keep getting larger, stronger, and smarter by the day. Sooner or later, they Not will crush us. I'm sure there's nowhere else to go, but maybe something up there could help us. I have the order. I'm, I'm not sure we could possibly be not endangering ourselves for like this. But, who knows? Maybe they found some secret maps in D6 that point to a storage unit of some kind. It's something that will save us. I don't know. No, you are the only magical solution. This incomparable plan. We can put it in the right. Oh, I can't believe my eyes. Artyom, you're all right. You gave us a scare, brother. Artyom, how are you, friend? I see you're all right. Gentlemen, give way. This calls for a celebration. Artyom few more scars and you will be completely irresistible to any woman. 
Speaking of which, Alyosha, how are you the nurses in the hospital? Huh? Could you just stop crowding him? <sighs> Brother. Welcome back, Artyom. Ah, Privyat, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. it's official. Yeah. I knew it. Oh, you guys are like so kids. I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. Artyom, the only thing I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. <sighs> Why, yes, and there's also those damn things, calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? Silent, Artyom? Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Move it! We don't need any extra radiation, darling. Oh, father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hanta off-limit zone. Have you been to all these ruins? See all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. I had to scare a demon away. It was getting too comfortable here. Look, maybe you should come back to the Order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. Your turn now. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa! Hear that? Turn the light off and come here. Probably heard us coming down from the roof. 
We're lucky the mutants hate each other as much as they hate us. I really don't get why this zone is off limits to stalkers. The radiation and beasts are nothing special. Stop. The pack is here. So, do we turn this place into Thermopylae, or do we let them pass? Wait it out. Looks like that was all of them. I'm glad they didn't notice us. That was a large pack. Oh, is this why the zone is off limits? I mean, if all the packs here are like that. We take the bridge to cross the railroad. It would save us a detour. Damn, too high. Hey, Artyom, help me get out there. Shit! Come up now. Got you! Did you hear that, Arthur? Something large, why? At least it's far away. Now that's what I call a blizzard! Can't see a thing! Or here! Let's switch the radio! things, right? A train! A damn train on the surface! Where? Shit! What do we do, Artyom? Should we catch up with it? Look! It's our guys from the Order! It looks like they're chasing that train, too! Let's join them! Hey, come on! Get inside! How did you guys get here? Did you see that thing out there? We sure did! Come on, get in! Picked up two more individuals at the railroad bridge. One of them is the Order Commander's daughter. You should have checked first, assholes! Artyom, thank already. God. These people, they're there. Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one Look, for what's that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, yeah, we'll yeah. tell the whole metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least. 
least give them their masks back. They won't be needing any masks. Watchmen broke through. Oh, workers are done for. Keep your weapon trained on the opening. If anything comes through, shoot. There, you at least know where the enemy is. Attention! The turntable is switching on. You know the rules. Rules? What rules? 
You're shooting people like so! You... Don't push your luck, old-timer. They aren't people, they're... Could you mean a cell? He needs time to cool his head. <laughs> We've had just about enough of your whining, you old fuck! You're heading straight for the ravine if you don't shut up. Now listen, if you come out of here, we won't accept this shit again. Okay? Understand? Animals! How can they? What can I do? A mutant? The watchman! Ah! A human! How did you... Oh. oh my god! It's you she's been screaming about! Alive! You came for her! All right. I'll help. Finally, I'll be of some use. Okay, they took the girl to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Turn the lights off. Granted. The watchman reached the brain. Why does that work? Oh, Yerma, do you threw your bout of conscience? Hey, what the hell is happening? It's the fucking breaker again. Looks like they didn't finish the repairs at the generator, Sergeant. Senya, go tell the workers. Oof, crouched. Checked. It's quieter that way. Oh, you turned quite civil again, Yermak. Stay so you close to the wall. your head after all. <laughs> Yermak, is that you? What are you mumbling? Come here and help me fix this. Yes, sir. Got me already. Come on, come on. Fixing this should be nothing for you. Yermak, what's taking you so long? Hey. His shoelace got untied. I'm coming now. Hey. Simon Mikhailovich, there's a failure at the generators. You what? see it. Is it yeah, safe in here? Yeah, I totally need you to tell me I what mean, I should do. Better area. fix this line here. Everything is under control. Come on, move it. You old bag of bones. Wait. You'll have to take him down. Can you do it quietly? By the way. What happened to the workers? What's with that mumbling? I'm just talking to myself. I got a memory problem, you see. Wait! Turn that light off! Don't come on me. Let's go! Wait! Wait a moment! Shut up! 
Who the fuck are you? It's you! Oh, God! Throw me at you! Alert! You fucker! Alert! Alert! Sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Moving. Here, quick! Let's go! All unauthorized Who are you? Andrei Ivanovich Yermak, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar, then God willing, I'll get you out of here. They know me, so I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, ah, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope... Uh, hey guys, be careful. What's going on? Hey! Hey, hey! Artyom, I see the enemy. <sighs> Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Atyom, incoming, two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Let's go check the back door, just in case. So, how do you think that was? Ah, 
Now you're just whining. You don't need accuracy to shoot cops by at point blank range. <sighs> yeah, but how about a watchman trying to snack on me? Then you pray and spray. At least we have three yeah. ammo. The generators will ship this now. Watch out your memory. With a scope, you can see them clearly from a tower. They spin if there's wind. They close if there's love. What's the point in actually going there? Don't give me that, Grigori. The enemy strikes where you don't expect. It's an alert, after all. That's true, I guess. Do you remember the time they had a shot at the second station? The Northwest had been coming for days, and you could hear signals from the outside. At least they could hear us, too. We're lucky to fix it, sir. So what were those signals about? I didn't hear before German came back. Washington? Washington is all right, don't you worry. Command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. Oh. I'm changing position. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon immediately. Civilian oh, personnel You're movement is prohibited hand until hand further hand notice. Hand Attention! The jamming system is coming back online. That's for sure. It's the outside gate, so it could only be watchmen. What if it's the attackers? Well, then those watchmen just have a nice meal and we don't have to worry. Well, if you say so. Still, this is suspicious. You do your thing and I'll just stay here, just in case. Oh, yeah. as if there be any of this. Hope they don't suddenly come out with something. Man,
Someone near the pillar. The guards won't let us get away. We have to do something about them first. Do something about the guards, please! Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch the turntable mechanism on. 
And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base on us. Heads up! It's the enemy! More guards! Get them! I see him! together. What you just stuck your heads in. We've no moves left. Ha! 
Once I can't take this lying down. Oh shit, the water is what? No, I won't be quiet. What is this jammer for? Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, what is in the Anna's ravine, there about, are sir. people from what other cities, dead! All Get of them, women, up. children! I'll tell you all later. Everything. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They called the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to this not my this call, and you know Misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course. Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. Alright, Spartans! Throw these overboard and full steam ahead! Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch some air. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone! The whole fucking world! And not even batting an eye! Uh? Everything we have in their firebox. Please, let me do it, Colonel, sir. I will be appointing the volunteers here. Artyom will do it. Why Artyom? Because he started it all, and he better do something about it. Artyom, leap over as soon as we slow down. I will distract him in the meantime. Plastic, it's here. Is that you, Yakov? Yeah, so cut this shit, Miller. There's nowhere to go. You've never been out here. We have. We weren't going to go far. Just out of town for a bit till the excitement quiets down. And you just opened fire. Will you let us go if we stop? I have to detain you and bring you back to face trial. You do understand the charges you're facing, right? Desertion. Treason. Are you fucking kidding me? Me? A traitor? You tell me. Where are you taking that train, huh? On a simple joyride? No. I see only one answer. You've been fought and you're running back to your master. So the verdict has already been passed. We won't even see a trial. Cut that shit out. What are you carrying, man? Defense plans? You want to buy yourself a seaside retirement without life, you damn cripple? Plans? Treason? We have served you people without question for years. We have spilled our blood for the cause! You sold out! They destroyed us and you! I have been a soldier my whole life! I have dedicated my life to my people, my country! And I'll be damned if I give it to parasites like you! Damn, 
Saboteurs! We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green. As if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. <laughs> 